hoping you were going to give me documents or witnesses or best case scenario proof that the FBI is recording had been improperly procured something I could actually use well, just just use me no that's a non-starter Jason the FBI's evidence against Carly is hard it's damning that recording yeah not if I say I coached her that's only going to tack on another conspiracy charge look it's Carly's voice on that tape Carly was at the meeting there's no getting around that you now assuming responsibility is only going to implicate you right alongside her who's gonna who's that gonna benefit uh, all I gotta do is convince one juror that there's reasonable doubt then the whole thing's worth it I can't promise you that's not how this is going to work out you won't save Carly you will condemn yourself strengthen the prosecution's case against her my friend I know you have the noblest of intentions but actually I could use your assistance with another aspect of this case. What? My defense strategy will be to spin the story. I'm going to present Carly as a sympathetic defendant. Convince the jury that she lied in that meeting to save herself and her children from a group of vicious mob bosses suspected in a wide range of crimes, including several brutal murders that she feared for the lives of her children and herself and that she literally bluffed to save her life lying to these people to push them away jurors love to rest like that carly said that you think her chance of acquittal is what 30 percent we can do better than that not much better